How's it going, everyone? Maryland here, and oh man, all right, it's time for another day of Animal Crossing New Leaf. Um, sorry that the stream is just a few minutes late. I was trying to figure out why on earth I wasn't hearing the sound. No matter what I did, nothing was working. Did you try turning on your speakers, Devin? Oops. Um, <laughs> oh, it happens to the best of us. Okay, so everything's good. I just, you know, after, um, oh, there was some volume thing I had an issue with yesterday. So I wanted to make sure it was okay today. Well, I couldn't hear it, so yeah, that was kind of a problem. Anyway, let's see. So, Benchton. Um, trying to think. What did I do yesterday? I did go to the island and I got some bugs and I paid off my home loan. However, I decided not to go talk to Tom Nook afterwards. And there's a pretty good reason for that, actually, because, you know what? I think, um, oh, here we go, another gift. I think I can choose where I upgrade my next, um, room. Pico, well, hi. <laughs> How are you doing? Hi, Devin. I'm glad I ran into you because I wanted to tell you this in person. It may seem sudden. No! No! You will never leave! No! No, 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 no. You are staying no matter what. Um, don't leave. No! Alright, no. So, she may leave, and that's not good, but she's too cute to leave. We can't let her go! No! So that's why it's always important when someone does that, you definitely want to talk to them. See if you can persuade them to stay. <laughs> that's pretty important. Okay, anyway, where was I here? Let's go ahead and... Oh, it's a present from Pico. It made me so happy when you came over and said such nice things about my house. This isn't much, but I wanted to show my appreciation. Wow, that's great. That's why you can't leave me, Pico. Um, it's toaster. <laughs> why, thank you so kindly for that, that toaster. Oh, look at that. Here's the new fairy clock that I built for you, Pico. You can't just leave me after building that. All right, um, I should probably delete some of my messages, too. Okay, let's see how the flowers are doing. I think they're doing okay. Except I'm thinking about it, I think I forgot to water them yesterday. <laughs> oh well. Oh, and my golden peaches are ready too. Jeremiah. Jeremiah, let's see. Good evening, Devin. Wait a second, it's not evening at all. Let's try that again. Good morning! Did I need something? Yeah, I need some coffee. Um, last night I was watching a show on TV called Star Homes. It was pretty amazing. Wait, I'm having a brain flash. We should do the same thing in Benchton. Okay, sure. Oh, man. Every single time. It's like they set me up with this trap here. All right. Well, we're, we're going to do that. Okay. Um. Wait, who's that? Did I... I thought I saw someone over here. No, well, apparently not. It's just my house. Just my house. No problem. Oh, right. So, you know what we did last time? What's his name? Cyrus. He finally woke up! So, I let him go to town on one of my couch things. Actually, I just bought the couch right here. It's already been replaced. Um, wait, is this a different bird cage? It looks like a different bird cage. That's kind of weird. Oh, no, this is a bird cage. I have a bird house. That's it. Ta-da! Look at how he transformed it. So, it used to look like this. But, he let me recolor it into this. Although the cushions look pretty much the same. I guess they're a little brighter. Okay, so cool. Yeah, very neat. Only takes 30 minutes or so, and then he'll finish. And it's not too expensive either. So that's pretty cool. Um, yeah, so I could go ahead and put that in my house. But I don't feel the need to right this moment, because speaking of my house, I'm going to get it upgraded. So let's head on up here to Main Street and see what's going on. In fact, I think we can buy shoes. Oh, yeah. The one thing we can't buy, though, is anything in Nookling Junction. It's in the process of being remodeled right now. 
Which is a good thing, but I can't buy anything today. Well, that's fine. All right, let's see. So we're gonna go in here now that I've paid off my loan. Oh my goodness, so good to see you. Yeah, so paid it off and now I have access to my second floor. I've really paid it off totally. Ooh, this is a cool looking door. Arch mermaid door. Or I guess, kind of think of it, it is kind of mermaidy. <laughs> um, all right, well, let's talk to him one more time here because I want to expand. Um, your home needs more space or perhaps maybe an extra room. So now that I have the second floor, I have several different options here. I can either go for extra room or more space, which I guess that kind of sounds rather redundant in thinking about it. And does it still say playing Secret of the Stars? I thought I changed that last night. You know what? Twitch has been very twitchy about the titles of things. Like, every time I tried to do that, it just totally messes things up. Like, it logs me out and everything. All right, let's just set this up really quick. So what should I do, guys? Um, extra room, by the way. That allows me to add an extra room. It's not, oh, I want more room. It's more rooms. And as you can see, there are several different options here, which is cool. So what is this, day 12? I think so. Um, and today is September 5th. Try to think where I should put the new room. Though, you know what? Expanding is also a nice thing, too. That's the other thing. So, oh, I could add a basement. That's kind of nice. Eventually, I'm going to want all of these. The problem is they're rather expensive. 348000 So, rather than do that, let me go ahead and add some extra room to the upstairs. Because it's very cramped right now. Or not extra room, more space. That's what I need. Um, I'm trying to think. Because right now it's only a 4x4, four four, and that's so small. Like, you can't really do anything in that. So let's see how much this is going to cost. Ow. Okay, that's rather expensive. <laughs> um, you know what? On second thought, let's go ahead and make another room. We'll make a back room. I guess that sounds cool. The basement is not counted towards your Happy Home Academy score. So if you're looking to dump a whole bunch of items somewhere and don't care about it, a basement's a great call for that. Um, let's go ahead and do this. So we're going to do first floor in the back. Yeah, that'll be good. And it's reasonable, I guess. Now. You see this house here? I think after you have all the rooms, you can make your house look like whatever's shown here. Um, okay, let's see. Yeah, but I don't quite have it set. <laughs> I don't quite have it set for that, so yeah, um, that's fine. Again, that's something I can do later. It does cost some money, but it does look pretty cool once it's done. Um, all right, so let's check out Oh, let's, wow, they're still building kicks. Thought that'd be done by now. They were working on it yesterday, but that's fine. <laughs> Have a gyroid-filled basement that you can go down into to hear their screams. Wow. Okay, so, Able Sisters. Ooh, what a fancy tie. I want to get that. Oh, Devin, welcome. Oh, this is good news. Take a look at that. Did you notice that big sh sewing machine over there? I've been using this machine of mine for quite a while now, so it acts up from time to time. Oh, yeah. Okay, so the cool thing about this is, um, oh, she can't figure out how to use the mis machine, so it's just been sitting there unused. This machine uses the Nintendo 3DS camera to read the QR codes of custom designs. You can also create a QR code for designs you've created. It's an amazing machine, specially made for professionals, but it just sits there collecting dust. Um, all right, well... <laughs> Mabel, I hate to see this machine you two gave me break down because I tried to use it without knowing how. All right, well, oh, I got it. Devin, you look like you could be handy with a machine like that. Why don't you get some use out of it in my stead? Yeah, okay. Well, that's fine. Um, okay, so this is actually great news. Now that we've talked to Sable enough, we are able to use this thing. 
And this is actually all we need to do for talking with Sable. Like, that's the end goal, at least as far as my knowledge. So we can either do read a QR code, which will use your 3DS's camera to um, read a QR code, which will give you a pattern. Or you can create a QR code. But let's just see how do I use it. <laughs> I can read you what's written in the instruction manual. Um, OK, so first you'll need a QR code of a custom design that was made using Animal Crossing New Leaf. Then choose read a QR code on the machine and decide where you'll save the design you're obtaining. After that, follow the instructions to use the camera. A normal design requires one QR code. Pro designs require a set of up to four QR code patterns. OK, the next page is about how to get a QR code so you can share your own designs. First, choose select a QR code. Um, the QR code that's created will be saved onto the SD card inside of your Nintendo 3DS system. And again, same thing about the pro designs and whatnot. So let's just try this thing out. I don't have any um, anything I can scan right now, but I will probably do that. A good way, if you're looking for paths and stuff, like my other town of Waffles, um, you can just search for like ACNL, you know, Animal Crossing New Leaf paths, and you'll probably find something along that. So that's rather handy, actually. Um, okay, so let's do create a QR code. I'm not sure if this will work or not. Um, you should only pick designs that you yourself created. Well, guess what? I did indeed create the Benchton flag. So I will go ahead and make this available um, to anyone. Oh, there you go. So all you need to do if you are playing Animal Crossing New Leaf, you should be able to just maybe maximize your screen just so you can see everything. And then, um, then I think you just do read QR code and try to scan that, that image you see there. So that's kind of neat. Um, yeah, so if you want the Benchton flag, that is how you get it. Cool. I'll make that available somewhere else, too. Um, maybe in the description or something. So let's see. Well, very cool, very cool. Um, I might go ahead and experiment with that later on, but you know what? For right now, I want to buy this suit. It looks so dapper. <laughs> All right, the official vibe of the work shirt is nice, right? Yeah. I'd like to try it on, please. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, I look marvelous. Okay, I'm going to wear this thing out. Look all official. <laughs> I don't like my pants right now, though, but let's see. Whoa, there's a weird mask. <laughs> the Lion Dance mask. 1,600 bells. Let me try it on first. Rawr! <laughs> I don't have my coffee this morning. <laughs> oh, sure. Let's go ahead and buy this. And then I have a Youngster Joey cap. I do want to buy this, too. Just so I can have it some time. Rawr! <laughs> All right, I like this. I'm, I'm going to stick with this for the episode. Blue pom-pom hat. All right, well, that's fine. Let's see. Um, is there a storyline? Like, what do you do? Well, think of it kind of like The Sims, I guess. I mean, there's a little bit of a storyline, but it's mostly just kind of kind of a simulator game. You know, you don't really have quests or anything. You just... You know, build your village. Check it out every day. And that tends to do it. So, yeah. It's not everyone's cup of tea, but it's rather enjoyable for the people who do like it. So, that's cool. I like it. I'm a big fan of it. But I could definitely see where, you know, some people would get bored of it. Oh, man, it's so much more fun playing with friends, though. Or even if they're online, you can still play online and have some fun. Hey, Biff. Big guy, Brozinski, you've got a rosy glow about you. You must be working out. <laughs> a rosy glow. What, what gave it away? Is it my face? All right, cicadas have amazing stamina. They make their sounds nonstop, and they don't get tired. I need to study them. Okay, I'll catch you, a cicada. All right, let's see. Oh. 
pick those clovers. I think rarely you can find a four-leaf clover. Doesn't happen all that often, though. Okay, let me go ahead and dig this thing. Yeah, get some fossils. So good, so good. Do, 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 do. All right, so I think this is what, Kitty's house? Well, let's check it out, since she's always out and about. Hey, Kitty, how are you? Did she turn her bed? You gotta help me, I've been looking everywhere for a toaster. Hey, how convenient, they're so trendy right now. All right, well. Uh, trade it for your record player. Sure, why not? I hate to re-gift, but... Might as well. Wait, what's that white patch on Kitty's leg? That just looks so weird. Have I not noticed that? Oh! Like, the in inner part of her legs, I guess, are white. That's interesting. Small little detail, but I just didn't even notice that before. I'm like, wait, what happened to one of your legs? All right, let's see. Rawr. Oh, I do find this amusing. Um, oh, I know what we should do. Oop, should bury this. Now, I know I buried a time capsule yesterday, but it was on the other side. So, yeah. <laughs> Guys, there's a crazy angry office worker running around town and digging up holes. <laughs> yep. Oh, yeah. <laughs> uh. Whoa, Isabel! Why are you asleep? <laughs> I don't think I've ever seen her asleep. That's actually rather adorable. Ah! Mayor Devin! It's not what it looks like. Okay, it's exactly what it looks like. But I was dreaming about work, I promise. Oh, that reminds me. We had a visitor earlier who suggested a new public works project. Oh! This is really good news! This is really good news. So, she wants us to put a dream suite on Main Street where you can take naps of vivid dreams. Cool, huh? So, this is definitely something that we want to build. Because this will let all of you visit my town of Benchton pretty much whenever you want. You can't, like, do anything with it because it's a dream. But it's super useful if you just want to check it out. Oh, that's so good. I think it's rather expensive, though. Okay, but... First and foremost, let's go ahead and hold a celebration for this fairy tale clock I got. I can't believe that Pico almost moved away. Alright, everyone. Welcome to the grand completion ceremony for Benchton's vital fairy tale clock project. Alright, um, yay! <laughs> Kinda looks like Claus is one of my workers or something. All right, everyone, on to the next project. Oh, yeah. <laughs> All right, so we still have a bit of work to do because if I recall correctly, it's a rather expensive project. But hopefully tomorrow, maybe we can do that. Hmm. I'll have to see about that. Like, I will work so hard to get that done. But what is this? I haven't looked at the notice board. Um... Oh yeah, the fairy tale clock. Well, that's good. All right, let's see. We got to get back there because I got to build this thing. Although, let me talk to Claus since he's right here. Hey, how's it going? I look like your angry boss. <laughs> he's so tall. Recently, I feel like the town has gotten a lot cleaner. Pulling up the weeds, picking up the trash, watering the flowers regularly. It seems everyone's really into the idea of making the town a better place. I bet this is all happening thanks to the Keep Benched and Beautiful ordinance you created, Devin. Yes, it is. How did you know? Is it because I'm that wonderful? Let's see. What is the dream suite? Someone explain. Um, to try and explain it, like, it's one of those things that's a little difficult to explain. Basically, you can visit any town by entering something kind of like a friend code, but you don't need the other person to add you. Which is super convenient, because, guess what, I have, like, no room on my friends list, so I can't really add people, but a lot of people want to check out my town, so rather than becoming friends or whatever, or exchanging friend codes, I can just give you my dream suite address, and you can check out my town and all my villagers and all that kind of stuff. 
um, which is pretty neat. It's actually a lot of fun. You get a chance to see some fun villagers and see projects, and I'll keep it updated from time to time, too. Okay, but let's work on a public works project, and I know exactly which one. Yeah, it's basically a tour of the town. That, that sounds about right. That's a good analogy. Okay, so we got to build this dream suite. It's 234,000 bells. That's kind of pricey, but it's not too bad at the same time. Okay, let's see. Have the donation gyroids sit inside the train station this time. Again, that's because it is on... Um, it's on the one place. Main Street. Alrighty, well. Let's see. I'm glad that's done. That's really exciting. I need to find a cicada, though. For Biff. Well, at least I can hear them. I mean, you know, they're pretty easy to find. Hey, Jeremiah. So many flowers. <laughs> oh, here we go. Another fossil. Another cool thing about the Dream Suite is I could check out other people's towns, too. Oh, no! I'm gonna fall! <laughs> oh, I'm gonna fall. So that's also something to consider, too, because that's a lot easier than adding friend codes, and you're not limited as to how many you can have. So, I don't know, maybe, maybe from time to time I can check out people's towns and stuff. Okay, let's see. I know that um, Chugga Conroy has a pretty cool town. He's done an Animal Crossing series, and he has his Dream Suite address, too, which is pretty neat. I wouldn't mind checking that out. Oh, I hear a cicada. I see a cicada. All right, you're mine. Yeah, gotcha! I'm the one walking the walk now. You know it. Oh, hi, Mantis. I don't really need you. Mm, the problem is trying to make all that money this early, because you make the most money later at night. The bugs on the island, so good. Oh, hey, how are you doing, koala? Oh, it hasn't seasoned the day, huh? I'm starting off full throttle, too, no, huh? Hey, you're going over to see Claws anytime soon. If you are, there's something I want you to give back to him, okay? Sure. All right, well, let's go and deliver this to Claus. If I can find him, I don't know where he ran off to. But it's okay. I'll track him down. Man, this is a great day. I have access to the, um, the whatchamacallit, the sewing machine. <laughs> That's it. That's it. I have access to that, and I also unlock the Dream Suite Public Works project. So tomorrow, hopefully tomorrow, I'll be able to get that going. That'll be fun. Don't you think my room here needs a little something for the floor, how now? More like an accent, not a showstopper. Hey, how about this thing I have? I don't even remember what I got. Um, not this bug. The record player. All right. <laughs> I'm just, oh, she's setting it down right now. Yeah, perfect. Here's a thank you gift. It's like I'm playing this big trading game or something. It's a range. Thank you so much. Wow, that's awesome. Oh, now you have music playing in here. I kind of want to dance to it. <laughs> Okay, um, wonderful. I need to go to the museum. Donate my fossils. That's what I need to do. Yep, yep. I wish kicks were open, though. Wouldn't mind getting more shoes. Okay, let's see. What do we got going on? 
trying to think of what else to do today. I haven't talked to Benedict. I haven't talked to Hopper yet. But they might be asleep, too. Hmm. All right, well, let's go to the museum first and foremost. Also, I'm looking for a T-Rex torso, I guess it is, over in my Waffles town. I decided to put a T-Rex in my room. <laughs> Seemed legit. But I was missing that one. Like, I, I assessed all the fossils I had for that day, and it's like I had two pieces of the T-Rex. So it's like, hmm, well, might as well go over the third. Right now it looks like some kind of bone snake thing. Because I just put the tail and the head together. Alright, blathers. You can stop blathering right now. Um, let's make a donation. I would like you to take the... Yeah, these things, it's fine. All right, well, wonderful. Cool, so, that's great. That is great. Now we have more fossils, and we even have two that we can sell, which is cool. Definitely don't mind that. Um, hurry up already. I wonder when they're going to be finished. Oh, I guess I'll go in here and get maybe some flowers, or maybe, I don't know what else. Ooh, an axe, though. That's pretty tempting. Should buy a sapling. Wait, how much room do I have? I only have room for two things. Oh, that's a shame. I'll come back here. <laughs> Man, so much work going on. That's crazy. Guess it's good to see. But, oof. Oh man, I want to get that dream suite. Claws. I needed to deliver something to you. That's right. <laughs> he just looks so funny. Like, I didn't like him at first, but he's kind of growing on me. Alright, is that the thing I linked to Canberra a while ago? I just assumed Canberra was going to keep it for herself. <laughs> Let's have some fun. What do you think is in here? If you can guess correctly, I'll give you a present. Um... I don't know. I think it's probably going to be clothing. I don't know why, but... Oh, hey, I was right. Wow, Devin, you're incredible. It's clothing, just like you guessed. Did you peek? Well, as promised, you deserve a prize for such fancy guessing. <laughs> Here, you're going to tap this. I don't really want it. Oh, it's a rugby shirt. Didn't I already get a rugby shirt? And with that, my hands are empty, but my heart is full of joy. I think I already did. It's the one that kind of looks like... Mess. Yeah, that's right. Actually, I bet you this red down jacket. It looks a little bit more appropriate with the dragon, but I, I like this official look. <laughs> okay, um, I don't really need that shirt, though. So let's take a quick trip on over to retail. We're going to sell some of our stuff. And here I go with that Wii thing again. You know, it's like... I explained this in the last stream, that I say feel like I'm playing with you guys, you know? I know it's me. Oops, no, I want to keep my down jacket. Actually, I don't really care. I don't like that thing anyway. Um, don't need a rugby shirt because I already have one. Blue cap. I'll hold on to the blue cap. Just in case I want to look like youngster Joey. Yeah, let's get rid of these things. Decent, decent. Still have a ways to go, though. That's fine. What do I need to do? I need to deliver a cicada to Biff. Jeremiah, what's up? Don't you dare leave me, Pico. I'm mayor. I won't let you leave. All right, where did Biff go? <laughs> Uh, let's go find him. Don't know where he would be, but he was walking around somewhere. Hmm, where was he? Like, I thought he was right over here, but I did not see him anywhere. That's a real shame. <laughs> 